as this can all be done in three weeks. Once you sit there one day and plan out everything that you have, boom, boom, boom. It does not take you that long to get all of your business started and actually get everything down, your Instagram page, your branding, everything down in three weeks. Only thing that can take a long time will definitely be trying to find which vendor you wanna use. talking about how to start your lash business in less than three weeks <laughs> okay so let's start off um, with saying that you guys have to get a journal and a pen that's the most important thing that you need to have before starting a business I feel like writing out your goal plan and what you want to do and what you want to accomplish and how much you can spend and what your budget is and who you want to spend your money with and stuff like that. So writing all of that out is very important. Um, also, putting money aside. So definitely budget. Um, I know I was working a part-time job and a full-time job. So my part-time job was kind of like spent like I just used that money as spending money so I just use it towards whatever like if I wanted to go shopping if I wanted to pay on my business that's what my part-time job is usually used for my full-time job is used for my personal bills and my savings so I save from my regular full-time paycheck for my personal stuff my bills and my part-time job goes to my business um so definitely do that. I would say definitely budgeting for your business is very important. Um, also, I know people talk about like getting an LLC and should you start off with that? So currently I don't have an LLC for my business. Um, I'm under general partnership under another business. So I'm basically an independent contractor. Um, I wouldn't say to get an LLC if you're not... I was okay don't get me wrong LLC is very important to get like once your business starts booming you have a lot of income coming in invoices coming in stuff like that it's definitely important so you can so since you're protected by LLC so definitely get an LLC if your business is booming and a lot you have a lot of a lot of clientele you're making over a certain amount of money a year so where you have to file taxes so definitely having an LLC is definitely important um, to me personally, I've been in my lash business since July, so I kind of do want to wait before I get an LLC, um, just to make sure like I'm really serious about, really serious about my business, really knowing like this is something I'm going to do forever or growing on my business. But as of right now, I do have that mindset, like, yes, I'm, my business is booming. I'm getting a lot of clientele, you know, stuff like that. So definitely LLC, my suggestion, suggestion would be to wait about maybe two, two to three months or six months, maybe you might scratch that six months, <laughs> six months after your business it started you'll see how everything is going for you see if you really like it and then go apply for LLC because LLC is so cheap um I don't want to get too much into LLC that could be a whole nother video um but yeah so back to starting your lash brand um definitely number four would be researching vendors do not y'all do not ask somebody what their vendor person is, like who they go to. I've done it before. And I, <laughs> you are not, let's just say this. I don't think someone is gonna give you their actual main vendor that they profit up to sell their products. And I feel like they're gonna just give you another vendor just because you asked them for a vendor. And personally, you may not like that vendor so you're going to have to research you're going to have to research and a good website to research lash companies any type of com companies like you want to go to is abla.com i'm going to put the link below um 
abelia i feel like it's abla abelia something like that i don't know how to pronounce it um they're a good way of researching companies um i've met a lot of companies on there my current vendor isn't from there though but i've met a lot of companies on there i've sampled their products um definitely having whatsapp so WhatsApp is a, a great way to communicate with other vendors in China. Nine times out of 10, your lash vendor is from China. Like there's not too many lash vendors in America. So most of them are in China. Um, to communicate with them better it would be through WhatsApp. Um, it's free. It's free on their end. It's free Wi-Fi calling, free, all of that. So I think that's very important. Um, definitely when you research your lash vendor, like... Maybe try to come up with a contract with them. Um, I just looked up like contract templates on Google. <laughs> and um, I made a contract up with one of the vendors that I have because I know that's, you know, who I want to keep. And that's who I love my products and I've had great reviews from them. So definitely building a contract with that person and your brand is very good because they're gonna be like oh yeah she's she's serious about her brand like we need to send her like these products yes because i will send it back to you because you signed my contract and i will sue you if my products are wrong okay <laughs> so yes yeah, definitely um sign i'm doing a contract with another business is very important just so you're receiving the right products um if anything goes wrong like coming back here then like you know you can you have liability like hey you signed this contract and you said you will be able to pro provide this 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 and like if they don't provide it for you then you know sis get that lawsuit going you know what i'm saying <laughs> get that lawsuit sis <laughs> but no definitely getting um like you know like a contract together and sending it over to your person that you find is really good um definitely first starting off when finding vendors i would say find 10 vendors first find 10 vendors narrow it down to five the best five that you can have and sample sample email them whatsapp them ask them look i'm trying to sample one of your products can you send me this they are going to charge you a shipping free fee because it is china so shipping fees like 25 dollars and stuff like that so yeah so you may have to pay like 25 dollars um but yeah so pay for that shipping fee girl because you don't want to pay 400 to 500 dollars getting their products because they wholesale everything so it's not like you can buy like hey can i just have 100 products they're not going to do that they're going to want to be like well i can only send you 400 pieces for this amount of money so before you spend that much money on a product that you haven't even worn before before selling it out to people sis sample okay <laughs> because trust me like you need to sample because sometimes like these vendors don't you know they think that their stuff is a1 but it's not so definitely research um if you ever need help researching um vendors please hit up my instagram page at lash out with toya and i can always help you i do have a list of vendors that i like that's really good i've sampled from all of them there's 10 vendors um, you can get that list from me just dm me and i can send it to you um also i have like all my notes down on here guys um so creating a logo so that's also important for your business as well and guys this can all be done in three weeks once you sit there one day and plan out everything that you have boom 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 it does not take you that long to get all of your business started and actually get everything down your instagram page your branding everything down in three weeks only thing that can take a long time will definitely be trying to find which vendor you want to use so i would say like with the vendor part is going to at least take you a month and then just before you start your business make sure you have some money girl because y'all i went broke <laughs> I spent so much money on my business like you go broke like it's you're gonna have to put in like, like people say you got to put in money into your business to make money okay like sis it's true sis <laughs> um okay so next I have on my list is create a logo um creating logos I use canva.com girl sign up for canva pay i paid a dollar 99 because sometimes they be charging if you want to use a little cute logo but sis it is worth it like 
Canva.com is really nice with advertising, making flyers, sale posters, like putting your pictures on there. Girl, do it. Um, also, another website is, y'all, this is a really good website. I don't know if I should be giving y'all this. You know, I don't want everybody to get used up by people, but <laughs> you can just DM me for the other Create logo and I'll let y'all know. <laughs> but they are so good, y'all. They make your, it's like a whole bunch of um, people on there, like graphic designers, and they make your um, logo for you, sis, and they show you before they send it out. So DM me on my Instagram page and I'll let you know another place, but Canva is definitely really good. Um, also websites, so they have like Square, um, oh, Square Space, Big Cartel is free. Um, there's some other ones, I'm not sure off the top of my head right now, but I know Big Cartel is free, that's how I remember that one. Um, Square Space, that's good. Webly.com, um, to me, I use Wix. Wix.com. I love Wix. They let me get my own domain name. I did have to pay um, $150, but it's $150 per year. Um, and that sale starts in December, sis. So make sure you do all of that in December. Like, <laughs> it's like, nah, but their sale is in December. So I got the website um, for cheaper. So it was on sale. Um, so yeah, so I started my website actually January 1st. Um, of this year, 2019, um, which you guys can visit at www.lashoutwithtoya.com. Um, so that's my website, and I use Wix. They're, they're really good. Um, I can't vouch for any other website. I know with Wix, it can um, you can collect payments. So I put my products on my website as well, and I can collect um payments people can do online orders it can send out newsletters like every month like automatically like hey guys i have a sale going on like stuff like that so i like to get everyone's emails address and i'll put i'll actually put like the people i know that give me their emails into the newsletter just so that they're getting it too even if they didn't purchase from me um wix also lets you like give out a coupon co code after someone like shipped out their like after someone like purchased their product from you on their website so i really wix is really good you guys like hands down i can vouch for wix um they have templates on there so and they also have people on there that can help you design your page um yeah so that's really good so with all these being said you guys <laughs> this is how you can start your lash business in three weeks don't get discouraged like it can be very discouraging sometimes trying to research and find brands and knowing like uh, trying to figure out like is this the product you want to sell and stuff like that so i definitely want to let you guys know like if you need anyone to ask just hit me up in my dms they're always open or comment below under this picture i'm always willing to help like everyone to succeed like lash business there's so many people that do lashes like sis. Like, I'm not the only one <laughs> that do lashes. Like, anyone can do lashes. So it's just like, why can't you do it too? Like, why can't you boss up and be a bossy a baddie like me? <laughs> but yeah, so definitely that don't get discouraged. Um, it's, it's money out here for everyone. Like, money here for everyone. Get your coin, sis, okay? <laughs> so yeah guys don't forget um another thing is to create a name it was so hard like i feel like i went through three <laughs> i went through three names guys like for my business and i literally had to sit down like girl what do you want to call yourself like so definitely researching what you want to call your brand um i do individual lashes so that's why they're called lash out with toya um i also sell lash products like lash strips so I call them Slay Minx. Um, so this, I kind of have two names, but only one name for my business. This is just what I call my lashes. So with my lashes, guys, advertisement, sis, advertisement. <laughs> so it comes with the lash applicator. So this is my lash applicator. Um, and it also comes with, comes in this little cute, little, you know, 
travels kit it's really cute y'all like when people pick it up they be like yay and it's kind of like cost effective like you got to come up with ways to figure out like how you're gonna like like sell your product and what's gonna cost you and how much it's gonna cost you so getting bags like this is really cheap instead of you having to buy the bigger bags with the tissue and all of that like sis get you one of these little cute cases because it's really cute <laughs> um also so the applicator comes in that actual box um and then it comes with the lashes so here's one of my lashes guys it's so cute so there's slay makes and then this is another one you know so yeah so those are two of my lashes i do have four different kinds um so those are two of my lashes and they come in the box with the applicator and a small glue just so people know like what to use while getting um their products um but yeah guys like if you guys want me to do like a whole video on how to brand your lash page i can do that um i'm also a consultant with branding your last page so definitely let me know um yeah so Definitely, guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my video. And if you guys want to know more, like I said, DM me on my page, Instagram page, at Lash Out with Toya, or comment down below. All right, guys. Bye.